Allow me to demonstrate. Oh god. What? This guy literally jumped his death. <laughs> I'm good. <laughs> Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. Today we are playing a game. What game? The little gator game, of course. I don't know too much about this game. I just know that it's cute, cozy. I watched the trailer and I was like, huh. Oh, seems like a chill game for me to play, so I'm gonna try it out. That's enough laying around. I wanna do something fun. Big sis will play with me. I wonder where she went. Oh, just like that. Oh my god, look how cute. <gasps> oh my god. I love it. Look at me waddling around. Oh, there's my big sister. Big sis, big sis, big sis. I'm bored. What are you doing? Pfft, just looking at an article for that Legend of Hero game. Puzzles, monsters, the usual. Oh my god, is that a reference to Zelda? No, I don't want to read about it anymore. Can it be out already? Uh, no, for real. <laughs> I think the Zelda, the new Zelda game came out today. Or was it yesterday? I don't know. I want to be the legendary hero. You and me both. Uh, but we don't need single player Legend of Hero. We want something we can play together. How hard even is it to be a legendary hero anyway? You just need a sword and a shield. And a hat. Of course, a silly pointy hat. And you have to be clad in green. I am green. Great, you're already halfway there. As a matter of fact, hold still right there for a minute. Oh my God, I look so cool. It's like you jumped right out of the magazine. Now, as is tradition, you must choose a heroic name. What about Heroi, Heroson, Hero-Meister the third? Pfft, okay, but this is what all the NPCs are gonna call you for the whole game. Your name can be as silly or serious as you want, as long as it means something to you. Oh, we get to name the legendary hero. What should we name him? I got it. So we're gonna call him Lincoln, but it's spelled this way. <laughs> Lincoln. I am Lincoln, hero of legend. Pleasure to meet you, Lincoln. Now you need some kind of quest, but what? We need to get you up to speed. Set the stakes with something dramatic. A hundred billion years of darkness. <laughs> A little over dramatic, but I can work with that. How about it? It all started 100 billion years ago. A brave hero set out on a quest to find something fun to do. With the help of their big sis, they made a whole fantasy game with rules and everything. They also made a pact to last all of playtime, no work allowed. But one day, after many a playtime, big sis went away for school, leaving the little hero to play alone. As time marched on, it seemed like the hero would never get to play with big sis ever again. Until one day, when Big Sis came home for a fall break. Maybe now they could play again, just like they used to. Feels like just yesterday, huh? Haha, <laughs> yep, those hundred billion years really flew right by. Kinda makes you want to jump up and do it all again right now, doesn't it? Well, I really have to finish this group assignment. Oh come on, you've been working on, on that all day. I barely got you to come out here with me. Yeah, sorry kiddo, it's a tough project. Plus, I haven't heard from the other members in a while, so I'm having to pull a lot of extra weight myself. But uh, don't worry, I've had to punch above my weight before. This project doesn't stand a chance. Yeah, you're my amazing big sis. One little assignment is nothing. You'll finish this thing before we even know it. I believe in you 100%. Ugh, oh, this is so freaking adorable. Oh, look, a frog! And now she'll never finish it in a million years. <laughs> Dude, tell me she at least looked at the decorations. Those took forever to put up. Not even a peek, but thanks for trying, guys. Oh, sorry, Lincoln. I wish there was something else we could do. It's okay, Jill. We all did our best. 
We can make monsters and treasures all day long, but we can't play the game for her. Avery, that's it. I'll play the game for her. <gasps> they said it couldn't be done. Care to elaborate? Right now, all this stuff we made is just loose cardboard lying around. Empty pots besides empty waterfalls so that don't even have any cool secret caves behind them. There's no story, no drama. We need to put it all to use. A legendary hero, an epic quest. We have to show her what she's missing. Are you sure we should be trying to distract her from a school project? I've been doing college level work recently, trying to get into that prep school. It's really hard. It's no problem for my sis. It just takes a million years and I can't wait that long. <laughs> She'll have like 10 million years to finish it later. I'm not entirely sure that math tracks. It tracks, just a thought, but have you tried having a grown-up conversation with her about all this, you know, before attempting to gamify the whole island? We have a rule about that. No grown-up stuff during playtime. The only way to get her to play is by playing. Just enough to get her hooked again, please. You already had me at drama. <laughs> I guess I can make my study break a little longer to help out. Well, if everyone else is on board and you really think this will help, I trust you. Yes! Alright, let's get to work. Each of you will make a quest for me to complete and reward me with one of the hero items. Avery, your quest is for the hero's hat. Hat. Quest. Got it. Bye! Martin, you'll handle the shield. Gotcha. And Jill, the sword. Leave it to me. Exactly. And I'll play through the game myself to show my sister how much fun we're having. I'll do the quest become the hero and win over big sis sounds like a plan that might almost work possibly you're right it will definitely work that's not what i said don't worry scales we'll ace this assignment for sure hey sis i'm gonna go play with my friends just a normal run of the middle day on the island nothing special or exciting happening to my knowledge uh okay kiddo have fun then <laughs> oh i will <laughs> oh my god this is so freaking cute I feel like this is just so relatable for so many small children where their older sibling is going off to college this really puts in perspective on how little kids feel oh no dangerous beasts you hero please you must help these vile creatures have attacked me a defenseless NPC <laughs> do you have a weapon hero a weapon? Oh, no, I am lacking my sword. Do you know where I can get one? Ah, scaled traveler, I have heard many a tale of a mythical sword. The stories claim it to be deep in the forest, hidden away in a magical grove. The only heroes of true heart are able to draw the sword from its impenetrable base. That sounds difficult. Eh, I'm sure you can manage it. You're the hero after all. Please, you must retrieve the sword and save me. Oh, no, dangerous beast. Oh, my God. The faces on these cardboards are just so freaking cute. <laughs> okay, so where's the sword? Please don't jump on the rock ledges. Well, that's not gonna stop me. Oh, here's the sword. The stick. <laughs> wow, the magical special sword. It's, it's a stick. Yeah, I guess it was pretty short notice. Quick, I have to defeat these enemies and help Jill. <laughs> oh, just like that. Oh. Craft stuff. Oh boy, junk. I should probably hang on to all these bits and pieces of stuff I'm breaking. Maybe we can recycle it into something new. Hang on, Jill. I'm coming. Me and my little wobbly self. I just want to hit all these cardboard monsters. Dude, they made a whole tree? Oh, it takes multiple hits. Dang. Big ol' serpent. Dude, my sister's just not looking at all. She's just so into her work. Coming. Wait, you're doing homework. <laughs> Use the special sword to help me. <laughs> oh my god. 
Oh, oh, is that all of them? <laughs> wow, super cool moves, hero. You have completed my quest. I mean, yeah, thanks, but you're back to doing schoolwork. I thought you were playing. I am, I promise. I just trying to squeeze the practice quiz on the side. <laughs> I'm a little stretched thin right now studying for that prep school. I don't want to waste any time. But the second you need me, I'll switch gears again. Okay, well, see you later then, I guess. Sis, sis, check it out. Oh, he has a little phone. Oh, <laughs> that's so cute. I found a special sword in the forest. Aww. And I rescued Jill from scary monsters. Very cool. Don't break anything. Ha, uh, okay. She loved it. <laughs> okay, what's next? Oh, I should check in on Martin. I think he's in the sandy area. Okay, let's go to Martin. <laughs> She's not paying attention. You having fun, kiddo? Yeah, so much fun. It's almost contagious. Ha, right. Oh, don't be such a bummer. Play with your little bro. Oh, here's the rest of that serpent. Wow, there's so many. Is this Martin? What the heck? What's going on here? You've got this, Lincoln. Uh, you sure? I'm pretty high up. Don't worry, the legendary hill can climb any height. Oh yeah, I'm a hero. Oh, oh, is this part of his imagination? It must be. Oh yeah, this is part of his imagination. Oh, that's sweet. Oh, there's Martin. What's this thing do? Oh, oh my God, it's a race. Uh, Yeah, it was a race. Let's not do that yet. <laughs> Martin, what are you doing? Just chilling. Oh, hey Lincoln, I've got the shield ready. Let me go grab it. What? No, you can't just give me things. It has to be a reward for a request. Doing quests is the only way to become the hero and for my sis to play with me. Right, talking to her is out of the question. Completely out of the question. We went over this. Playtime, no grown-up stuff, quest, drama, fun. But maybe if that doesn't work, we can try talking to her. Too bad it's going to work perfectly and we won't need to. Ha ha ha. Fine. You want a quest? How about a fetch quest? Fetch quests are the best quests. Oh, dude, they're so tedious. Oh, I mean, uh, I sure do love me a fetch quest. <laughs> so go over there and grab that thing. Oh, okay. I need it. For reasons. Uh, huh. Well, yes. Okay. Quest time. Fetch the pot. Alright, Martin. <laughs> oh my god. His friends are something else. Thing get. Pot? Got it. It's a pot. Weird. I wonder what Martin's plan for this is. Dude, you probably just use the lid as a shield. <laughs> Here you go, Martin. I got the pot. Reward time. Wow, amazing. Went over there and grabbed a thing and came back. <laughs> Martin. <laughs> Truly a task worthy of being called heroic. So here's your reward, hero. Pot lid. This is, Martin, this is the thing I just gave you. No, it's not. It's your shield. Really? Yes. Wow, a shield. Amazing. <laughs> In addition to defensive capabilities, this also makes a great sled. Can't wait to find a hill and slide down it on this pot lid. Or, I mean, shield. Well done, hero. You have completed my quest. Yay. Yeah, thanks a lot, Martin. Now go tell your sister you want her to play with you. Not gonna happen. Bye. Sis, I found this weird round thing. Weird, right? But my friend revealed himself to be an alchemist. Oh my god, this is so freaking adorable. I live for these pictures. He transmuted it into a shield. Incredible. Yeah. Phew. Okay, all that's left is Avery. They've gone and climbed the mountain, haven't they? Oh, we can test out that shield. Oh, wait. Oh, crap. Wait, what? Wait, what? No, okay. Do over, do over, do over. Oh, 
Oh, what? So I just need to use the shield. Yes, I gotta use the shield. Be right back. Okay, so let's see if I can beat this time. 332? Oh, crap. Oh, I don't even have to hit those. I can just go straight for the thing. Let's see. 312. Got this. Woohoo! Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Oh, why am I worried? I'm a freaking alligator. I can go in water. Oh, I can't go over there though. Shoot. Look at me. I am a predator. The most evil, vile, vicious predator. Hello. Oh, this is Franny. Hmm, where could it be? I can't find it anywhere. You looking for some? Yeah, there's a stick around here. It's my favorite stick. <laughs> Uh, I feel like it. <laughs> I left it right here in the center of this conspicuous opening. Uh, stick? Stick who? Uh, I'm gonna tell the truth. Uh, was that your stick? Haha. <laughs> Oops, I thought that was for me. My friend told me there was a sword hidden in the forest, and when I found that stick, it seemed perfect. A secret sword? Oh, that reminds me. While I was looking for my stick, look what I found. Oh! <gasps> yes! Whoa, a wooden sword. This must be what Jill wanted me to find. Thanks a lot. Do you want your stick back? Don't worry about it. You can hold on to it as long as you're enjoying it. See you around. See, this is what happens when you tell the truth. You get rewarded and or like good karma happens and I got a freaking wooden stick out of it. This is why you should always tell the truth, kids. Always tell the truth. Oh, it's a memory. Destroy the water. Ah, it's so slippery. What? Oh no, the water has evil in it. <laughs> that must have been when they were younger and she didn't have to go to college or something. Oh, what the heck? This is creepy. Look at him. That's scary. Hello. Hey, have you seen? It is I, the bracelet shop. Look upon my array of beauties. Do you not desire them? Covet them? Hmm, tell me, what is it that you truly want? Uh, I'm looking for my friend Avery. They're a frog. Yes, the energetic one. They have ascended to greater heights. But do not fear, for you can follow in their footsteps. With the help of my bracelets. <laughs> You're saying a bracelet will help me climb cliffs? They are bracelets of power. They imbue you with strength. The strength to keep going, to tell the world who you are. To ascend over your every obstacle. To hold tight to the truth in your heart. Okay, okay, I'll take one, fine. Hoo-hoo, as I thought, you desire my bracelets. <laughs> More than anything else in this world. Mayhaps I could be persuaded to part with my beauties for a price. You carry confetti and cardboard in tow? No? You want the scraps of our broken crafting stuff, but it's just a bunch of junk. Ah, but they hold value to you, do they not? <laughs> then they also hold value to me. Because I can take that value away from you. <laughs> Would you like to buy one of my beauties? Only a hundred. Really? Yeah. Yes. Hoo-hoo, <laughs> wonderful here. Take my beauty and make it yours. Oh, it's blue too. Blue's my favorite color. I got a bracelet. It gives me the strength to climb walls. With only one, my stamina is pretty low. With more, I could climb longer. But do not be mistaken. One is never enough. Look upon my array of beauties. Imagine the strength they lend me. If you still yearn for my beauties, seek me out. You will find me where you least expect. Goodbye. Dang! You just did a matted trick and just disappeared. Please don't climb the cliff face. Dude, these, <laughs> we are just breaking every rule. 
Who are you? Simon. Hello, fellow mountain climber. These bracelets sure work great, don't they? Oh, I guess so. Doesn't make a lot of sense to me. They're just bracelets, right? It might be placebo. Not a chance. I myself am, of course, a proficient mountain climber. When that frightful character told me that they could help, you bet I bought one. Dude, so <laughs> they knew that that monkey was scary. <laughs> Heck, I bought four of them. Now look at me. I can climb anything. They go anywhere. You fellow mountain climber. We will have a climb off. Oh! Sure, I'll take a challenge. I will traverse this mountain and hide amongst its peaks. If you think your meager one bracelet is good enough to match my abilities, prove it and find me amongst the mountains. Deal. Challenge accepted, bruh. He must be up here. Oh, 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 crap. Rock monsters. Oh, look, it's Avery. Oh, hey, Lincoln. Uh, wow, um, what is all this? It's something to spice up our game time and impress your big sis all at once. A restaurant, those create lots of conflict, and grown-ups love conflict. A restaurant? Conflict? See, there will be an opposing restaurant that badmouths them to the press, and then act two, all their refrigerators will mysteriously be unplugged overnight. Oh, the drama. With all that spoiled food, how will they impress the food critic? Not to mention all the interpersonal tension between the chefs. Uh, I don't know, all this conflict is a bit stressful, don't you think? Uh, stressful? Yeah, uh, it kind of feels like grown-up stuff, doesn't it? Oh no, not grown-up stuff. Forget I even said anything. No stress out loud. Whoop! Ah, uh, there it goes. <laughs> so, the hat, right? Did you at least make the hat? Right, the hat. Um, to be honest, I forgot everything you were talking about the moment I left. <laughs> I freaking love Avery. But you seem to have a pretty clear idea of what you want. Why don't you make the hat yourself? But, but... It needs to be a quest. A can-do, hero. Your quest is to craft a hat. There we go. Simple. <laughs> Jesus, what kind of friends are these? Look at me. I'm sweating. Stressed. They can't even help you out. Oh, look. It's a mountain climber. Ah, fellow mountain climber, you have found me. What took you so long? I bet you think you're quite the hotshot now, having traversed these treacherous cliffs. Little do you know, you have a lot to learn. You have learned the art of ascent, yes. However, you are quite lacking in the art of descent. Allow me to demonstrate. Oh god. What? This guy literally jumped his death. <laughs> I'm good. <laughs> What the heck? So, have you learned from my example? <laughs> I, uh, I guess. <laughs> Hi, it requires much practice to achieve this level of mastery. Dude, <laughs> you just jumped to your death. Go and perhaps one day you will measure up to my abilities. It's not that hard. I don't think it will be. I just don't want to do it. <laughs> wait, am I supposed to do it? Oh my god, wait, wait, hold on, hold on. Are you sure this isn't dangerous? Ha! Huh, of course it's dangerous, but as we all know, in video games, children are invincible. That is true. That is very true. It's pointy. It flops around. What more could you do? Okay, so this is the hat. Oh! <gasps> Just like that, I made the hat! All natural gator hats are always comfortable when you have fins. Dude, that's so cute. Look at me. Channel the power of the rag doll. Oh, I need more confetti. Hey, that wasn't so hard. I made a hat all on my own. Quest complete. Oh, I mean, almost complete. I have to show Avery first. Yes, let's show Avery. Wow, what an excellent heroic looking hat. Ha, thanks. Does this satisfy your quest then? Oh yes, absolutely. And even better news, I remembered something about the game. It has a glider. It makes exploration so easy. 
a glider? The ones I played didn't have that. Oh, well, I must be thinking of a different game in the series. <laughs> Dude, this is totally a reference from Zelda. Anyway, hero, for fulfilling your heroic questing duty, I must reward you. What? Reward? But I already have that hat. Hero, I must depart. Please take your reward as I leave you goodbye. Glider? Is this a shirt? Every, every way, whose shirt is this? I guess this must be the glider they were talking about. I mean, uh, wow, a glider. Simply jump again in the air to glide. Sis, sis, sis. I have ventured to the top of the mountain. I had to climb all over. And at the top, a special hero hat. Aww, look at Avery! <laughs> Freaking Avery, I live for Avery! Looking sharp. Yeah! That's everyone, phew. Okay, okay, okay. All that's left is to go recruit my sis. I'm ready for this, right? Yep. You're totally ready for this. Look at you. Alright, found my sister. Oh, all my friends are here too. So, what do you think? Just a sec, let me finish this thought. Uh-huh, uh-huh, and done. What's up? Whoa, you're done? No, 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 I'm nowhere close to finished. But I've got a minute, what do you need? Well, look at me. I'm the little green hero. And all those quests I've been doing, it's just like the game we played. Oh yeah, you sure have been busy. Yeah, it looks fun, right? Oh, kiddo, yeah. Just like old times, right? Kiddo, I think it's great that you're playing with your friends, but I've really got to focus on this project. Still? Aww. But I did all this stuff. Why'd you agree to come if you weren't going to spend time with me? Remember our promise? Playtime means no grown-up stuff, right? Kiddo, I... Maybe you're right. I guess I'll just get out of your way. Oh no, don't say that! Go ahead and have your fun without me. No! That's not what he meant. Well, so much for a legendary quest. Dude! <laughs> Martin! <laughs> oh, sorry Lincoln, I guess it wasn't meant to be. What? <laughs> no way, didn't you see that spark in her eye? All I saw was the bags underneath them. <laughs> oh my god, Avery! <laughs> I'm telling you, we almost had her. We just didn't wow her enough. We need to go bigger and better. We need to go there. What? The big island? Imagine all of this, but over there. A bigger forest, a longer river, a taller mountain, an irresistible adventure in every direction she looks. There's no way she'll be able to say no. What do you say? I don't know, dude. The entire big island? That's not what we signed up for. Honestly, I'm exhausted just from working on this one. Oh. Hey, Jill, aren't you supposed to meet up with your school group soon? Oh my gosh, you're right. What time is it? Oh, I hope they didn't start without me. Sorry, Scales. I'll see you later. I gotta get going, too. Some guys are expecting me at the splash pad. Dude, Martin is so chill. And so cool. Good effort, team. <laughs> you gonna be okay? Uh, yeah. I'll be fine. Don't worry, buddy. Maybe we can win her over next fall. Or maybe not. Bye. Oh my god! <laughs> oh my god! Oh my god, I love Avery! Now what? <laughs> Oh my god, I love that! <laughs> uh, uh, who's texting me? What's good, Lincoln? You coming or what? Who's Tom? Tom? Coming where? We were waiting for you at the island and you didn't show. What? No way, I'm on the island right now, by the playground. Wave at me, I don't see you. Tom, that's the big island we said to me on the little one. Oh, my be, my be. I was out here like, where are those guys? <laughs> cool news though, I texted like everyone and a bunch of peeps came out to help build stuff. Really? That's incredible. Yeah, but y'all weren't here so they wandered off all over the place. Oh. I think they are still doing the game though, just in their own space I guess. Oh? Yeah, you got a big charisma, you can round them up again, no problem. I'll send anybody you met on the little island an invite too. Great, thank you, this is amazing. We could really make an island wide game happen. It's practically begging to happen, to be honest. 
But listen, come meet me at the playground first thing because I got big ideas for decor. Dude, I cannot with these abbreviations. I'm s <laughs> I'm next to the blinky radio tower on the big island, not little one. Lol, lol, lol. Oh, is he a llama? Cool, cool. I'll be there soon. Okay, okay. Eyes on the prize, Lincoln. It's not over yet. All you have to do is go corral a bunch of strangers and turn them into your friends. <laughs> Fine. Find Avery, Martin, and Jill and convince them to get back on board and compose a dramatic spectacle the likes of which the world has never seen in a single afternoon. Easy. This will be a walk in the park. <laughs> oh, and I shouldn't keep Tom waiting at the playground. Time to head for the radio tower. Hey, big sis. Better grab a laundry basket because I'm about to knock your socks off. Oh my gosh. I'm having so much fun playing this game. It's such a chill, cozy, cute, funny game. But I think I'm gonna end the episode here, guys. Tell me how you feel about this game because I really do recommend it. For those of you that just want to chill, relax. And thank you so much for watching. I love you guys. And I'll see you in the next episode. Bye.